everybody, Road Warrior 627 here, bringing you my first Need for Speed Rivals video. Now, if you look in the upper right-hand corner of the screen, you will notice that I am not starting from scratch. Um, I never thought, I never thought of doing this game in a video. It's just a game that I really didn't play that often, and I just went like off and on again, on and off. You know, just uh, whenever I wasn't playing another game, I would hop on it. Um, I played this a lot on the PS3. Um, when it first came out, I got it on release day. It was the only game I ever got on the day it came out. And nobody was at GameStop, so it was really nice. Um, but I would like to... I'm really excited for the new Need for Speed coming out. But um, with Carbon done, Most Wanted done, uh, really shied away from those games recently. I, and I started playing this yesterday again and I thought let's just do like some random pop-up gameplays so we're level 16 as a cop right now for some reason I always do the cop career first um even in hot pursuit I did the cop career first because you know need for speed you always do I do prefer to be a racer but being a cop it's kind of cool because you don't do that all the time like every need for speed you could be a racer but only a couple like this in uh, Hot Pursuit and some of the old, old Hot Pursuits from like the late 90s, uh, which I played on PS2 um, like six, seven years ago. And you could be cops and so that's why I always do cop career first because it's just something different. All right, so I'm in a public lobby right here. Uh, what are we going to do? We're going to go um, just... I don't think we're going to get up to level 20, which is the, which is where you unlock the last, well, it's when you actually complete the story, because you, it all, it goes all the way up to level 61, so I mean, it really is, uh, an extensive game, it goes on for a while, but, you know, whatever, um, alright, so, uh, let's get started. Exit the garage, I think we're going to... Just gonna gold any two hard events. Alright, so the easiest thing to do is obviously like the uh, time trials or whatever it is. Um, the, um, what is it? What do they call it? Uh, rapid response. Alright, so let's try this one. Haven't done it yet. See how it is. I'm in the Lambo right now, I believe, which I just unlocked. So see how the Lambo feels. I haven't played this on Xbox yet. Uh, I played it on PS3. It was my first time trying it on Xbox One. So this should be uh, interesting. I'm gonna start right here. So we gotta make. So we gotta get 6.8 miles in 2:23 flat. All right. So this is gonna be a little tough right here. But um, we should be up to the challenge. I hate the time penalties. That's the only thing. When you're a cop, you get time penalties, but you're a racer, you don't. I think that's a little friggin' stupid, but uh, whatever. Are you kidding me? I just sideswiped that guy. I really got a penalty for that? That makes me pissed off. We got 4.7 miles, and we made it in just 50 seconds. Or about 50 seconds, I'm a little off there. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Come on, come on, get out of that cutscene. The cutscenes are so damn long. We have to get four miles in like a minute. Oh man, I don't think we're going to be able to do this. Shoot, this is a tall order. It's a really tall order. do this, but I'm not going to count on it. We got another time penalty right there. And another one. So that's great. Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. Is the audience you got to be like cheering me on even though I can't even hear you. Come on. We got to make it. We got to make it. 
There's this guy who's standing in just one spot that we gotta get after. Oh man. This is really gonna be. Ah, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Like six seconds. No way. Ah! Yeah, I missed it. Wonder if those penalties dug me in. Alright, so we're gonna try this again because that was. We definitely could have done that better. Restart the event. And we definitely could have avoided that. Uh, we're still gonna try and do this. This is a pretty hard thing. Oh, and just one paying attention was looking at the computer for a second. That'll definitely kill you. Oh, you know what? This is impossible. Forget this. We're gonna restart one more time. We have one more shot to do this. I'm not even gonna look at anything else. I'm just gonna look at the screen. I'm just. Focus. I literally feel like I'm about to sprain my finger. I'm holding it down to the point where it actually is starting to hurt. It's not the greatest idea because of the fact that we could crash, but this seems like a pretty big straightaway. Well, I'd rather crash into the wall there than crash into that car. Ooh, that's gonna be tight. Ugh. And just literally if that was in real life, I would have just killed the driver. I would have had a lawsuit on my hands as a cop. I'll tell you what, guys, if we can't do this, we might have to change it up a little bit. I mean, rapid responses are like the easiest thing to do, but in this case, it's really not. This is a pretty tall order. Oh, like six, almost seven miles in less than two and a half minutes. I mean,. If a guy could do this in real life, I would give him like all my money because it's like impossible if, 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 if somebody could do that in real life. And we just hit the back of that car, probably killed the driver there too. Yeah, so we're going to have about 23 seconds to go two miles. And that's not going to happen. You know what, guys? We're going to... We're gonna head back to the uh, place here, and we're gonna we're gonna like change some shit. No, uh, let's, because I, I saw there was an assignment that featured like interceptors or uh, whatever. So we're gonna try that instead because this is really being annoying, and we could probably have more fun doing that anyway. So let's see what we can do. I can change the assignment, see what we can do. I feel like I'm in school right now. I have assignments that I have to do. In school, I don't even want to think about that. Alright. So, I could probably complete that assignment really easy. I'm just not going to try all these other races. I'm going to change the thing right here. Gold any two hard events. Gold any three interceptors. 
That'd be fun. Well, I need two That's hot pursuits. Darkness. We're gonna try the interceptor. I am better forged from granite. So we gotta go three interceptors. So we're definitely gonna put some damn pursuit tech on here. We got shock ram level two. That should be good enough. And we got ESF level three. All right. Oh, this is interceptor though. I tell you what, EMPs might come in handy here. They're almost like projectiles. Well, they are projectiles, and not like projectiles. They are projectiles. Level two should be good enough. And let's see what we can do. Maybe we'll start off with an easy one, then we'll go, uh, then we'll go further. Maybe we'll just do an easy one that we've done so, with, that we've done before. Get started on that, and then we'll try some medium, and then we'll, maybe we'll try a hard one. Should get more points for that stuff. So let's try it. Alright, alright, ladies and gentlemen, we got an asshole coming through. Asshole coming through. Alright, let's see EMP. Gotta have a good setup for this thing. God damn it. Fired the shotgun at the wrong time. Okay, where are you, buddy? Come on. This guy's got the ESF on right now. Shock ram. Trying to get this thing on his ass. We were hit by the ESF, but we got a lot of damage on him, too. Just got hit by the shock wave. Alright, we got EMP. We're gonna try EMP again. We got really heavy damage on this guy. Just gotta get this one more hit on him. Should do it, and we got it. 111 and 3 fifths. Not bad, not bad at all. All right, so we gotta do three of these. Let's see what we got on the map right here. Okay, we'll just do do another easy one, because we do want to rank up. We don't want to waste too much time worrying about stuff. Our damage should be a little higher. I'll tell you what, let's pull in here first. Reload our damage, because if, if you go inside the command post, you just automatically get your damage, uh, or get your car's health or shape up, whatever you want to call it. Cars really don't have health, yeah, cars are living things, they have health, yeah, they gotta breathe in all that nice gas that tastes like shit to everybody else. Alright, so let's get, um, outside, now we've done that, actually, we could just go right there. I'm too lazy to drive, like, a half a mile down the road, and just do it right from the station. Too lazy. This guy seems to have pulled ahead quite a bit early on us here. This guy's pretty damn fast. Look at this. Whoa, this is not even, like, fair. How far is this freaking... Oh, okay. Not as bad as I initially thought. All right, let's get the EMP on him if we could. And we do. Get a nice big hit on him. Let's see, try and get the shock ram. We got that on him too. Oh, we made the turn. We gotta go after this guy. Going down the hill. Well, I just pressed circle. I think of nitrous because of how much I've been playing carbon. Get right up on his ass. Put the shock ram on him. Well, this guy's going pretty fast. Oh, no. 
Let's see where he's going. Going down this way. Shop ramp. This guy's almost dead. Bye, buddy. Hope you have a nice day in jail or where that car guy wrecked. Maybe, maybe he's going to the morgue. That'd be sad. Uh, that'd be sad. You don't want to take anybody's life when you're a cop. Oh, we got these guys right here. Let's go after this guy. Just for the hell of it. Why not just go for this guy? Trying to get a shock ram on him. Only a little bit of damage from that one. Get the EMP. Tell you what, we're gonna have to hit the repair shop before we do our last interceptor. Got a big hit on him to finally take him down. Nice. Wait, we still got another guy? Ah, oh, whatever, I don't see him. I'm not gonna bother with this guy, I'm just gonna leave him. Alright, so let's head to the uh, gas station. To, uh, regain some car health. These cars do have to breathe, like I said before. I believe there's one right up the hill over here. I'm gonna hit this and then hit a, uh, an interceptor and then we'll be good to go. And we'll be able to uh, rank up, see what car we get next. I'm not really sure because I haven't been paying attention to that. Like I said, I've been playing this game off and on, but on and off, whatever. Um, yeah, but it's just, it's just a really nice game. Uh, I do suggest you go out and get it. Um, I'm sure the prices drop significantly. I think it's like 30 bucks, 35 bucks now compared to uh, the 60 it was that I got it for on release date. All right, let's see what we got over here. Cage the Beast. Got a closer one? Medium the hard way. Could try the hard one. The, the uh, medium one. Tell you what, I might change my pursuit tech, though. Before we do that. I'm gonna try something different. Because I feel like all I use is the EMP, the shock ram, and the ESF. I feel like I want to try something different. The spike strips, I don't want to do. Because uh, I suck with those. They're just kind of annoying. Alright, so figure we'll do this one last race. We're only going to go up one level, but, you know, whatever. It's our first video. Um. Yeah, so once we get to level 19, we'll do the actual last, like, race in the story mode. We have to go up this, up against this guy named Zephyr. It's an interceptor. You just have to take him out. It's not that much of a big deal, but you do need a fast car because he, his car is just crazy and he's a level 10 and blah, blah, blah. All right, so let's see what other pursuit tech we got in here. We got the shock ram, EMP, we got a helicopter. Yeah, but those things I never trust. That's the e uh, that's the ESF that I usually use. EMP roadblock. Hmm. Let's try and get a level two roadblock. Get a level two roadblock. What do we got? Let's put the EMP back on. Got the EMP in the roadblock. We'll try that. Alright, so let's see. We're just gonna pull up to a random interceptor. Okay. It's an easy one, so lucked out on that. Control Freak, it's called. I just tell you what, speaking of Control Freaks, I'm thinking of getting Control Freaks with the K. I got really positive, um... 
words about them from a couple of my friends. Uh, they basically just extend the analog stick a little bit, like put a little bump on it. Um, and since all the different controllers have uh, different textures, um, it's supposed to just like keep it uniform and stuff. They're supposed to feel really good in your hands and blah blah blah. So I figured I might try them. Uh, they said uh, they're really cheap. They're not, you know, they're like maybe like uh, three dollars for two of them. So that's nothing. In today's world, that's nothing. I mean. You know, I live in uh, New York. It takes uh, sixteen dollars if you don't have Easy Pass to go to Verrazano Bridge. And, uh, so you got the end pitch looks like a corner of roadblock too. This is a really good place to do a roadblock, in fact, because um, the road's really tight over here. If I remember correctly. Let's see. I'm gonna come up here. Now, I could really easily take this guy out, but I want to see how the roadblock works out. Let's see if it actually does anything to him. And he just went right around it. So, you know what? I'm just going to take this guy out. Oh, that guy's got a ESF on him, so let's just take him out with the EMP. EMP countered. And I'll just knock this guy out. Oh, I just got hit by a shockwave. Hell, we might actually have a little trouble doing this. We never have trouble. Oh, yeah, we might have some trouble. Jeez, how much time we got? Oh, he's right there. Put another roadblock up. Maybe we'll be able to get him. Got another guy on him, too. Ah, never mind. We got him. 148 and 4. Not bad. The assignment's complete. It only took 10 minutes. Not too bad. Not the best I probably could have done, but not too bad. I probably could have done a lot better if I was really on my A game, but hardly ever on my A game these days with a bunch of stuff going on. All right, guys. That's pretty much. Yeah, just getting the command post here. Let's see what. Uh, See what vehicle we've unlocked before we uh, call the video. Now I don't, I'm not sure what to call this series because I always in my in like the middle of every title I have the series like I have the game and then I have the series in all my titles that I put in capitals. I don't know what to call this. I could just like number the gameplays. They're just like random pop up gameplays. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet, but obviously you'll find out once this video is on YouTube. And let's see what we got. First of all, we've scored 17,971 speed points. And I'm not going to read all the other stats because that's too geeky. Alright, so we've got new pursuit tech, new car, blah, blah, blah. And let's see what it is. Aston Martin. That looks sick. That reminds me of the Chameleon in GTA 5. Ooh, look at this list we're going to choose for next time. Jesus Christ. They cannot outfight us. Got lots of stuff to do. Alright, so it appears whatever we have to do, we have to earn 100,000 points in a single session. So that's going to take a little bit. Um... Undercover, gold, any three events, drift a thousand yards at 160 miles an hour. That's not too hard. Drive fast into 10 for 15 seconds. 15 straight seconds, or not sure. Average street speed zones at 130. That's no problem. Get six hits with pursuit tech, earn 100,000. Three rapid responses, 10 near miss in slant, 15 races. This seems a little too complicated. They have no like, you got too many events. I like just messing they around in no public. So, you know what? I'm going to go for this one. Right for responses, I could just do the real easy stronger. ones. Near misses, that's not hard. Slide and slam 15 racers. So, we could build up our XP while we side slam and take down a bunch of racers. Let's do patrol. Why not? I mean, it really doesn't make a difference. I don't like undercover so much because I do like the writing on the cars. 
because there already are a couple of undercover cars that are just undercover. So, um, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching. I've gotten a lot of positive feedback seemingly from nowhere from a couple of people in the comments. I have 22 subscribers. I'm very happy with the way YouTube has been going lately. Um, got a couple of nice feedbacks uh, from other people. Um, so I, I'm really uh, thankful for that. You know, this is just something I like to do. And, you know, nothing I really took. Uh, you know, it's just something I enjoy. So just going to try and keep it going as long as uh, you, the audience, and I enjoy it as well. All right, guys, that's going to be it. Thanks for watching, and peace, guys.